Hi, I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. You can contact me with this information. In today's lesson, we will learn how to start your GST module. Let's log into your company. Okay, company ABC username is admin, password is admin. So we log on. Now, you can only do this if you have already registered for GST and you already get the approval. Do not start your GST if you have not get your approval. Else, all your transaction will have GST elements which will make it incorrect. Okay. Now, there's a GST over here and click start your GST now. So the first thing, of course, you need to select a country, Malaysia. Click on the next button. Select the Malaysia flag. Click on the acknowledge option. Click on next. You need to take note over here is the GST effective date. In general, GST start on 1st of April 2015, but may not apply to your company. Your company may only start GST on 1st of October 2015. All this is depends on your registration and approval. So you must confirm it by looking at this confirmation letter from custom to your company and you can see that there is a Tariq Quad Quasar Pendaftaran. This is 1st of April. So refer back to your own company approval letter. Then only you can you should put what sh which is the date. Remember, if you put in the wrong date, GST will have a wrong impact. It will have a incorrect return and the penalty will be very high. So Please make sure you do this part correctly. So click on the next button. Put in your GST registration number. If you do not have that with you now, no problem. You can key back later in file, company profile. So click on next. Now, this part also important. Do not touch any of this account over here. SQL accounting system is very complete with GST automation. A lot of functions such as 21 days to spare that relief can be done automatically through the system. If you touch any part of any account over here, the processing may not be run correctly. May not be run correctly, so you have problems later. So what you need to do is just click on finish. So the system will require you to log in again. Okay, to know that your GST already started, very simple thing is click on your GST again and you can see the list of all GST functions. So, that's how you activate your GST module. That's all for today. If you do have time, do drop by my Facebook. It's facebook.com slash syntax technologies. You can get all the latest information regarding GST and SQL over here. Or you want to watch previous tutorial video, just go to my website, syntech.com.my slash YouTube or click on the YouTube button, then you can have all the tutorial video. So again, I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. Thank you.